Hey diecast fans and collectors, I decided to go out and get some paint for my cars and I just found a lot of new Hot Wheels. Um, I think I completed B and C case almost. I just need to find that new car that's popular over in Korea or Malaysia, whatever it is, that red car. That's the only one I need to find. I seen it on the pegs and I didn't get it. And I, I, oh, I hate myself for not getting it because that's probably not gonna be an easy car to find again. But uh, yeah, I went out in the 20 degree weather on my wolf. This is my wolf rugby. This is what I hunt on. I only have two wheel vehicles. I have nothing with four doors. I don't have a cage. I only have motorcycles. Uh, well, mopeds and e-bikes is what I drive. But uh, yeah, I got these. I found a new Matchbox 5 pack I ain't seen yet. I'll probably do a video of that first. Oh, it's called the Matchbox Retro 5 pack. And it's pretty cool. It was like hidden in somebody's stash and I found it. I seen the guy stash it and then I went over there and grabbed it. I was like, what is that? Why'd he stash it? And I seen why he stashed it. It's pretty cool. But uh, yeah. Um, anyways, guys, uh, I'm going to head and get my paint because uh, I was just coming to get my paint and I was like, you know what? I'm going to stop at Target. And my knees are frozen. I can barely walk, but it was worth it for these. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm sorry. It's been a few days since I made the part where I was on my moped. Um, I had to do some crazy stuff, and I mean crazy stuff. My one moped, not the one in the video, but I have a three-wheeled one. It has one wheel in the back and two in the front. Uh, it The belt broke, and I stupidly told my apartment manager, and they're like, oh, you got to get it out of here. You have a week, and I, I, I realized your landlords are not your friends. They're, they're just people you pay money to. Do not tell them stuff that... Don't do that, stupid. They're not your friends. They're people you pay money to. That's one thing I got to remember. But um, enough about that. Uh, anyways, guys, um, I am glad I kind of waited to do this video because I took my wife to work today and I found a bunch of new cars I just have not seen like at all, like on Instagram or anything. Most of the time, they don't really focus on the fantasy ones. But man, some of these fantasy cars are actually pretty sweet. Like I'm not gonna lie. Um, and actually, guys, I'm starting to do this now. We'll show them in the package. And then we'll just pop them out like that. That way it makes it easier for me, um, too, because uh, I'm making the video and I'm getting uh, stuff ready to be put away. So uh, we got this Corvette. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, and let me know if you like the camera. My mom and dad got me a new cell phone because they didn't like my government one, and they added me to their cell phone plan. And I got, like, this phone. It's got, like, four camera lenses on it, and I thought it'd be the best thing to record videos on. So far, I'm liking it. It's got very clear picture. You guys can see the car very well. This white Corvette is very beautiful. Look at that. Very beautiful. Um, I got this one, which I thought was the treasure hunt at first, but I, I found, like, a lot of those. So I was like, nah, there's no way. And I, no, it's not. Uh, but yeah, there's that one. Pretty cool. So if you didn't get the Nissan Patrol uh, when it was in the regular color, I'm sure you'll be able to find one of these and you can make your own color. I know some people in other countries may have struggled to find that because it's a kind of popular car. I wish they would have put a spare tire on the back here because you could tell there's supposed to be one right there, but there's not. I'm sure on the real one there would be right there. But I mean, if you customize, you could add your own. But, uh, it's a shame because you're going to have a car without a wheel, but uh, I guess that's what you got to do. But uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. Rescue one, pretty cool. Only got one of those. If I didn't get a lot of the other colors of it, I probably would have got more of those to customize, but yeah. Uh, this thing's pretty cool. This bus, very cool. I like this. I have a couple colors of this already. I have a red one and I believe a yellow one or a purple one. But uh, yeah, um, very cool. Very cool. I love it with the cyclones and the blue. It's just a really, really beautiful looking bus. I like it. I'm working on making one of these an off-road camouflage thing. I'm working on that. And it's going to be lifted, so that's going to be pretty cool. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. And it's from the Fast Transit series, I guess. That's pretty cool, though. I like that one. That one off to the side. I also found a new 5-pack, uh, but we'll do a video on that on its own. Probably after I do this, I'll do that. Oh, but my wife told me I could open these because uh, she's seen them when I just got them. Some of these are ones I picked up the other day, and some are ones I picked up today. So far, the ones I'm showing you right now are the ones I picked up the other day and not any of the ones I picked up today. But I got this one. I know i got to pay attention because there's variations of those hands, and my wife likes these, so it's an excuse to get her a bunch of these. So 
I'll have to pay attention to that and get her some more of these. But that's a pretty cool looking roller coaster car. I like the colors. Very nice. Um, and then we've got the Braille Twin Mill. The pink one. Very cool. Or is it red? I guess it's red, but it's got pink on it. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Valentine's Day color. That's what it should have been, actually. That it's it's uh, called Hot Wheels Celebration Racers. So that's pretty cool. Is that actually in Braille on the package? No, it's not. That'd have been kind of cool if it was. But yeah, it's pretty cool. The blisters Braille. I don't know how to read Braille. I actually can't really tell the difference when I run my finger across it, but I guess like I like when you're blind, your senses are like heightened, so you probably like yeah, obviously can because that's how they read. But yeah, it's pretty cool. I like this car. It's pretty cool. I think we've seen this car in uh, Zamac and white. I think it's a bit of a confusing color. I know first time I seen that one, I was like, don't I already have that one? And I looked, I was like, no. I know this one's kind of a hard guy to find and. Uh, I'm not going to talk about it. I, I don't want to make you guys feel bad. But, uh, yeah. Anyways, um, yeah, I got that one. Very nice looking car. Look at that thing. That's a very cool one. Uh, them, the, oh, my gosh. It's going to be a fun car to customize. Um, just really cool. I like this car. It's just, it looks car. Like, I don't know how else to put it. It looks like a car. Like, it's the most car looking car I've ever seen. Like, that's a car. It actually looks, if you guys play uh, Amazing Frog on Steam, it kind of looks like the car from Amazing Frog, actually. That's a good idea. I actually might try to make this custom ones from Amazing Frog 3, I guess, out of, out of these. But yeah, uh, there's that one. This one, guys, actually was the hardest one to find. I'm not kidding you. Uh, the other ones were actually pretty easy to find. Well, obviously that red one wasn't, but uh, this one was almost harder to find than that red one for me. I had a hard time finding this F-150, and this is the one I really wanted, because I seen it one time, and I didn't have the money, and I had to leave it. And uh, then I seen it again, and I was like, oh, this time I'm getting it. And I got it. And I, you know what made me so mad, guys? I was digging through my wallet, and I found $60 behind a pocket in my wallet. And I had that that day when I was there. I could have got these cars a while ago, because I seen them a while ago. But, uh, yeah, um, right there. It's pretty cool. I like that F-150. Uh, I also found this. There was only one of these. I only seen one of these. I, I've been to a few different stores and had this case, and I've only seen one of these. I've not seen another one. So this is pretty cool, and it's probably a pretty hard one to find, but it's really cool. Look at this thing. And I already think I've seen the other color of this. It's coming out on Instagram. I think it's blue, I think. I think it's blue. It still has cyclones. But yeah, it's pretty cool. Look at that. That's a cool van. Um, oh, that's it. I'm going to try to show the old ones first, and I'll show the new ones I got last. There we go. There's an Audi. Very nice looking Audi. I may already have this, but it was only a dollar, so I was like, I was like oh, I'll grab it. I don't think I have it. I think I have it in silver, but when I get a car in silver and then it comes out in white, it confuses me, and I'm like, I'm like, do I have that or do I not? Even the picture is kind of like... Is that white or is that silver? But I got it. So if I don't have it, here it is. And it's a pretty cool looking Audi. I like it. Very cool looking thing. Looks really good in white. Very beautiful. Beautiful car. Well, let me know how you guys like the new camera. We might make this our permanent recording camera. When I do the races and stuff, some of the cameras will have crappy quality and some of them won't. Um, because I'm going to use different cameras. I've seen this thing more than anything. Like, there was like probably 20 of these at my Walmart today. These are like, um, these are not hard to find at all. I, I wouldn't think they'd be hard for anybody to find. They're pretty cool, though. I kind of hope the second color they come out with this in is, uh, if you bought the, uh, bigger pullback ones, I asked for them for Christmas from my mother-in-law, and she got them for me. I have a purple one that looks like this guy. It's black, and it's got like purple on the bottom of it and it looks like this guy and i'm hoping maybe the next color of this that comes out is the purple one the black and purple one i'm hoping that'd be cool to have the big one and then the little one that'd be pretty cool but uh yeah pretty cool looking little thing i like that one that's a cool looking 
color for that guy. This Hummer, I might get a few of these for my city because they say uh, special ops on them or something like that. It says on the back, this, I guess I actually can probably read this because how good this camera is. Here it goes. Uh, let's see, can you read it? Oh, man, I just made that terrible, didn't I? Um, let's see, what does it say there? Come on. Hot. And what does it say on this side? Does it say anything? No, that's just a line. Okay, you just need to read the middle. I was trying to get to focus on the Hot Wheels first response. There we go. Right there it says it. I did get a few of these. I'll just come out. Oops. I bumped my camera and turned off the video. I hope it's still saved because I don't know about this phone. But, uh, yeah, this looks pretty cool. And I'll be honest, I got a few of these because they're kind of cool for my city and stuff. Because they're, like, kind of like, I guess... I would say these are like security vehicles. These aren't really like army. They're like, these are like security vehicles. Like some kind of special, like if you play GTA 5, uh, like Merriweather, these are like their own like private security company, I'd say. That's probably what these are. They're pretty cool looking too, man. I like them. I, I wonder what the other color is going to be for them. It'd be cool if it was like black with the white where the blue is. Or the, the where the black is on this was white and then the truck was, um, black that'd be cool that'd be really cool i hope that is the next color of this that's going to come out that'd be pretty cool um so that was that one i got this porsche i know this is also kind of one people want to find i gotta find my buddy a few of these for camaros he has um but yeah there's that one right there yellow very nice looking car let me see if i can get it to focus better it's too shiny focus better there we go. Look at that. That's a pretty color. And I seen the other color, I guess, of this that's going to come out is red. I don't think it's a target red either, but the next color of this is going to come out is red, I'm pretty sure. I see it on Instagram. Um, and then, nope, that's a new one. That's a new one I got today. Uh, this one right here. This one, I remember seeing this one on Instagram, and I was like, I was like, oh, oh, I got to find that one. This one honestly wasn't too easy to find. I I, uh, I saw a couple of them, but I didn't see too many. But yeah, this one's pretty cool. I like this one a lot. And I seen the other color of this one that's coming out. It's going to be like a dark blue. I don't know which case it's going to be in. Probably F or something. I think I might have up the C case. I'm going to have to look because I think I might be missing a couple of cars. I couldn't believe this one car was there today because the local guy that comes in and he buys stuff and resells it in my town... I think he missed this car because he probably would have taken it because I'm pretty sure it's probably a car that sells for quite a bit on eBay right now. But uh, guys, by the way, if you want a rare Hot Wheels car, I notice at the first year they come out, they're pretty expensive. But if you want any car from last year from 2023, I know $5 is a bit to pay for it. That, that's like the most expensive I've seen. I've seen the Godzilla Nissans on there for like $5. And that's not too bad for them. It's better than paying 20 or whatever the heck they were going for, because I would never pay that. But uh, pretty much any car you want, as long as it's not a treasure hunt or a super, any mainline car, just don't buy it immediately on eBay, because it looks like once the new year starts, they go way down in price. And that's pretty cool. But yeah, there's the HKS Ranger. Pretty cool looking guy there. Um, let's see, I think all these might be ones I bought today. Man, I think I bought more today than I did the other day. Or no, no I didn't. I think I bought about the same. But all right, here come these ones. And then I got some cars I bought that were a bit more expensive that I haven't shown you guys, but they're open, but I'll show them to you. This one is so cool. Check this thing out. Look at the design on that thing. It looks like marble or something. That is so flipping cool. That's a McLaren. That's one I got today. Look at the, look, just look at the paint on this thing, dude. Look at that. No focus. Come on, you're an expensive phone. Do better. There. Look at that. It looks like marble. Look at that. That is so cool. I seen this car and I was immediately like, yep, got to have that one. That is just a beautiful, beautiful color for this. If Lego makes this in a, a speed champion, they should do it in this color. They really should. Like, this would probably be a really good model that would sell if they made this in this color. This is just... I would honestly buy that set just to get this. 
that is just a really cool color it's beautiful and it even shows on the package like when i seen that i was like oh that's cool i was like i doubt it'll be on the car and then i looked closer i was like no way dude it's actually on the car that's that's sick that is just a beautiful color for this thing this puts the white one to shame in my opinion i like that blue one a lot this here we've seen this before the mod rod it's an art car one, and it's going to be, I guess, in the Let's Race TV series. I can't wait for that to come out. Right there. Pretty cool. Camera doesn't like the white tires. Pretty cool looking thing. I wonder what the other color is going to be for it. What do you guys think? Black? Is that a Zamac? No, I think it's just silver. I don't know, maybe... No, no, it's silver. It's not Zamac. It's just silver. It's too clean to be Zamac. Yep, right there. Got that one. I got this Mazda, which there was a lot of. This one's pretty easy to find, I'd say. Come on. Is that a new tire on that? I almost want to say it is. Is that a new tire? Oh, no, that's just the spoke wheel. That's not a new tire. That looks cool, though, with the white around it. Man, I might have to get some more of these just for those tires, huh? Maybe. I mean, they're not in short supply around me, for sure. That is just, that's a nice looking thing. Oh, man, it's beautiful. Got that one. I got another one of this guy. Right there. Cool color for this. It looks kind of retro, actually. Look at that. That's a neat color for that. And the motor does move on it. Or the pipes, not the motor, the pipes. I think this is the third color we've seen for this guy, because I think we've seen this guy in white. It's like gray, I think. But this is probably the nicest color of it so far, in my opinion. I like that, it looks retro. Pretty cool looking thing. There weren't actually that many of that one, surprisingly, too. This one here, the uh, Rottweiler car. Hotweiler, I think is what it's called. Look at that thing. Oh, that's cool. Look at it. It's got like a, a dog crossbone thing on it. I don't know why this phone doesn't focus when I touch it. You, you would think it would. But look at that. That is just... Wow. That looks cool. I like that design on there. Some exciting new cars coming out this year. I'm, I'm digging some of the fantasy ones more than I am the real ones. I'm going to get me a few of these. I'm glad they made this a rescue vehicle because I'll be able to find a lot of these because of that fact. I'm going to get me a bunch of these. I love customizing these SUVs, and I just do not have that many of them. I'll probably get me like 30, 40, maybe 50 of these things. And I'm sure I'll be able to find that many because there's still a ton of the rescue duty at uh, my stores, like I could probably find at least 40 or 50 of those right now. Look at that. That is just, that's cool. I almost want to customize this one, but I won't. But yeah, that's, that's really cool. Just, that's neat. Gotta get me some more of these. Not to keep in the emergency vehicle collection either, just, just to have them. And there was only one of this. Year of the Dragon car. That's cool. I like this. It's like red and gold. and That's just really cool. I like that. That is just a beautiful looking dragon car. Turbo dragon. My wife had to have this. I, I seen it. I was like, hey babe, there's a dragon car. She's like, what? And I was like, yeah, we don't need it. And she's like, yes we do. And grabbed it. <laughs> I like to pick on her sometimes. But yeah, there. look at that thing, dude. That is just beautiful look at that i love the colors the red and the gold just look so cool together that is just a really cool looking car i see why there's only one of those this thing i seen this this was the first car i seen on the top and i was like oh, i don't have that now i gotta check because i didn't think my walmart was gonna get in anything new for a while because i thought i was ahead but no i think they got in like a case i haven't even seen this case yet and I was like, I was like, whoa, I almost didn't have the money for it. I literally spent my last penny on these cars. I'm not even kidding. I found a penny on the ground. I was like, oh, cool, I have enough. <laughs> but uh, yeah. Look at that. 
That is just a beautiful car. Beautiful color for this. I think this has come out in uh, three colors now. White, yellow, and now blue. And blue is definitely my favorite color. I like blue, so I'm going to be biased towards any blue car. But, uh, yeah, this thing is just is beautiful. I love this car. This car is gorgeous. There's nothing more I can say about it. It's just, I love this car. I absolutely love this car. There's nothing I would change about that car. I can't even customize one of those now because that is peak for that car. I couldn't make a better one. Well, maybe I can make one with flames, but I got this wheelchair car. Honestly, I probably could have waited on this one and got the other Tahoe and I could have another one of those to paint. But, um... Because this car is not, like, rare, like, at all. These always sit on the pegs for quite a while. I mean, I don't know. I shouldn't be saying that because I don't know about other countries. But here in America, this car is just not rare. Like, at all. Like, I see these. I still see, like, the original color of this that came out in some stores. Like, it's it's beat up and everything. But it's still there. This is just not a car that sells well. I mean, it's fun because you can put, like... Lego guys, I really you should get the Mega Blocks guys and put them on there. Like there's Hot Wheels Mega Blocks sets and those are cool. I gotta check on those pretty soon and see if there's anything new coming out of those. This, this is awesome. This looks awesome in silver. This looks amazing in silver. Look at this thing. Oh, that looks so cool. Oh, that's so cool. I love this. I think I like this more than the white and blue one. That is just really good looking for this car. That is just awesome. I love that. And then I got this car, which I guess supposedly my wife told me on the back you can use it as a mustache, I guess. <laughs> Hot Wheels always come out with neat little cars like this. It's got DD8s on it too. Mustache. Pretty cool looking little car, honestly. <clears throat> Let's see if I can figure out how to get the thing. It looks like it just like kind of flips out here. Oh yeah, yeah it does. Right there I can see it. It's There we go. Yep. Man, they could have made this into a comb too. Or is it actually a comb? You probably actually could use that as a comb. Like, I don't think it'd be the best comb in the world, but you could definitely use it as one. It has a little bit of a grab right there. <laughs> Man, Hot Wheels, you're always coming up with weird stuff. That is just a weird car, but that's cool. I dig it. That's cool. I like that car. That's really cool. Pretty cool car. New model, too. And this is cool, guys. If you don't know what this is, um, this actually already exists. In a Hot Wheel, but it's like a big thing that's supposed to haul Hot Wheels. It's like a little, a, like a, almost like a track, I guess. Um, but yeah, this this actually is sold like I think it's like thirty, forty, twenty dollars, something like that. But this is like a car carrier. I think that is so cool. They actually turn this into a Hot Wheel, like a, a small one. That is so cool. I seen this on Instagram a while ago. I was like, oh, that's cool. My wife will like that, and she did. She did want it. Hot Wheels Ultimate T-Rex Transporter. And I think that's actually what it's called. It's, and it's probably, yeah, it's going to come from that. I don't know if it's going to be huge in that. It probably is. They probably just were like, oh, let's make it small so, like, people will buy it or something. I don't know, but it's, that's pretty cool. I wish they'd do that with more of their bigger cars, just turn them into little cars, because that's kind of cool. That's really cool. There weren't too many of this one, too, honestly. They should have made this come with a big one. That would have been cool. They should have done that. That would have been pretty cool, actually. And then I found this one. This one, there was not many of. There was only, like, two of that guy. Um, but yeah, there's that one right there. There's a Jeep. I think this is the second color of this to come out. There's a blue one. I believe I already have. Yeah, I do. There's a blue one of these. This one looks cool, though. I like. I think I like this one better than the blue one. And you know what? This kind of goes with the Toyota 4Runner, I think, or whatever it is. That Toyota truck that came out kind of with this paint job. It kind of goes with it. I know it. Like they don't like go together at all, but the paint jobs do. That's cool. That's a really neat looking Jeep. And yes, buddy, if you watch this video and you want one of those, there's still one over there. It's in the back of the pegs. 
So if you want it, go get it, bro, because I don't got no money to get it for you. This one here, I guess it's from Hot Wheels Unleashed 2. I don't know. I don't play that game because I was very disappointed by the first one. Um, but, uh, yeah, pretty cool. I just wish there was more stuff to do in single player on the first one. We go right there. Look at that. That's a cool color for that. But I guess they're not doing what I was talking about with the coupe clip. I thought they were going to copy all the colors from the coupe clip onto these. Um, I mean, they still could, but this isn't the blue one or the red one. So, I don't know. Maybe they, they won't do that. That would have been cool, though. I wish they would have because this car looks like the coupe clip. I think that's literally what it's supposed to be. But, yeah, it's pretty cool. It's called Second Wind Coupe. Or, or si Segundo Coupe. I, I don't know what that says. I can't read it. This is pretty cool. First response. I guess it's a rescue vehicle. Look at the wheels on it. I love them wheels. Pretty cool truck. I think that was a new model for last year too, I believe. The Hummer in blue, which is cool, and I had no idea that was coming out. That looks awesome in blue. Absolutely awesome. That looks awesome in blue. That's just awesome. I love that. That is so cool. Looks so good in that color. Such a cool one, man. So cool. This... I saw this and I had to have it. It's a camouflage bus, man. Look at that. Got her. Look at that, man. It's a camo bus. That is so cool. This looks awesome. They should honestly do a five pack of military Hot Wheels vehicles with that paint scheme. That'd be so cool. I bet it'd be a hard one to find, but man, that'd be so cool. I wish they'd make more military vehicles and Hot Wheels. This looks really cool. Like, you guys did a really good job on this bus. This bus looks awesome. Even if the windows aren't painted, this thing still looks awesome. This just looks awesome. And I can't wait to see what the other color is. I'm imagining it might be either green or black, maybe. Or white. I don't know. But, uh, very cool. If it does come out in another color. But, man, that is just... Oh, that's such a cool color for that thing. And I guess we got a... New train? Is this a new train casting? I feel like it is. But it doesn't say new model. You know what? Actually, no, this isn't a new casting. This is... No, definitely... I would say it is because... There's no hitch on the back. I was going to say this reminds me of these trains I have that actually have hitches and they came with trailers they made a long time ago. They weren't out for long, but I have almost all of them. This reminds me of the green train I have. I'm confused. I feel like this is a new casting. I've definitely never seen this train before. West Coast Flyer. I mean, it looks like the green one I have, but it's not... Huh. Very weird. I'm going to look that up. There must be another color of this. Or it just doesn't say new model on it. But I swear that's, that's a new model. And I saved the best one for last. And I could not believe this one was still there. I did not know about this guy coming out. And I really hope the next color of this is going to be blue. In this exact paint scheme. I hope it's going to be blue. I really do. But I kind of doubt it. It's probably going to be either green or something. Or, but usually when Hot Wheels does a car in red, the second color is usually blue. So crossing my fingers, it's going to be a nice blue. Like this blue here would be pretty sick on it. Or this blue, I guess they couldn't do that because that's plastic. Or this blue, that'd be pretty cool. But I, I think I'd honestly prefer this blue, honestly. That'd be even cooler. Yeah, that blue would look awesome. Do it in that blue. 
I mean, I can't really tell them because they already decided. They've already decided every car for the whole year, I think. But yeah, that's that's cool. Second color of that guy. That looks awesome. That is just cool. I couldn't believe that one was still there. Only one they had, too. Just awesome. Really awesome. Look at that. Just Oh, I love that one. That just looks awesome. I love that one. Okay, guys, and then I, I got some expensive cars. Like, I got this at Menards. It's a Denver diecast. I got it because it looked like a bone shaker, and I thought that was kind of neat. What are you doing? Why? There. Okay. I got that at Menards because it's a bone shaker. I thought it was kind of neat. It's like a ripoff of a bone shaker. But it's kind of cool because, look, it's friction-powered. And it's got a wheelie bar. Check this out. Wasn't that awesome? Look how shiny that is. That's just a really cool one. I know it's a ripoff, and some people ain't gonna like that, but man, this is this is cool. This is really cool. Oh, uh, I got this at Hobby Lobby when I went back to get some paint I needed. Had to have that. That's a beautiful F-150. I guess it's a vintage ad car one. I know I said I don't usually buy green lights, but there's certain ones, if they catch my eye, I'll buy them. And that one definitely caught my eye. I never got the Sam Walton Hot Wheels truck. I wanted to get it, but I never seen it. So this is really close to it. That's actually better in my opinion. That one looks awesome. I love that one. And then I got... My parents got me this. It's a Chevelle Zinger. They got it at Ollie's. Pretty cool. They were telling me it was a Pontiac GTO, and I thought it was, too, but it's not. It's a Chevelle. When they showed me in a picture, I thought it was a GTO, but it's not. I didn't see the front, otherwise I would have known. I got this. It's an M2. I just loved it because it's a yellow Dodge. I wish it didn't have that. I wish it was flat, but eh, it works. It's still cool. Very cool. I wish they wouldn't have left the holes in it, though. I don't know why they did that, but, yep, pretty cool one there. And here's another one I got at Hobby Lobby, a dual-wheel Dodge truck with a hitch. And this thing is cool. I like this one because they didn't put the mirrors on it. That means I don't have to worry about breaking off in my collection, so that's awesome. And I was like, oh, yeah, that one's definitely coming home with me. Very cool. Paid the same price for this one as I did for this one, which is Kind of weird, because these are bigger. They're usually more money, but I guess at Hobby Lobby, they're not. This was still like $8. But yeah, definitely worth it. I love this one. Big dual wheel. I'd like to get one that's not a dual wheeled in red like this, too. But um, we'll see what happens. This one works, though. I like this one a lot. Just really cool. I love that. I think I may have shown this to you. It's a Majorette Pink Slip Mustang. I may have also even shown you that Dodge. But uh, not on the package. So here's the pink slip Mustang. Very cool. The door's open. Just really cool. Look at that. But yeah, that is uh, what I got. And this is just like some little stuff I went and got when I got paint and stuff like that. I just found like one car here and one car there. And I didn't think it was worth a video. So I just kind of had them up on my kitchen counter until I got a big bunch of cars. Or if I got, a bit, got quite a bit of them. And I was like, hey guys, I got a few cars i picked up or whatever but yeah i found a bunch of new models so i was like i was like yeah you know what i'm gonna give them their own video and uh i got a five pack video i'm gonna have coming out today too i'm gonna do that right after i do this so um i'm about to put these in my car room and i'm gonna be doing that